What up, Scorpio? I'm ready for you. <laughs> and I'm pleased. Even though that, that devil is right there. Even though he or she... Sorry, just closing the window. Because I remember this from last week. So, even though he or she is still about... That overall energy, you know, of the devil being tied to somebody for some reason. This could be, um, I'm just getting like divorces and children, some sort of legal cases as well. Like some Scorpios are tied to Capricorns in one way or another. Or Capricorns always like, oh, I don't know, but. I really, something's up with you lot, man, you, <laughs> something is up there, but I don't know, because you lot got stuff to celebrate, right, you don't need this bullshit, like, I know that, says, but they got something over you. This devil energy, it's not, this Capricorn, someone has got a hold over a Scorpio, 100%. Yeah, but you lot have got shit to celebrate, yeah? You're in a joyful position right now. You're happy about love and life and you're, you just had a, you know, you got that. You're oozing. You're oozing the good stuff. And then you got this caps here, like, excuse me, hello, what about me? Remember? Remember me? I will always be with you. And someone's like really controlling over you. Some of you are getting like tired of it. Trust me, you're gonna cut shit off like real soon. <laughs> That was it. Last week, I was telling you guys, you lot need to be careful. Like, I'm sure, I'm sure it was you guys. So and so, like, whatever. You got someone around you that's really draining you and stuff. Like, I can see some of you gonna just like, just cut it off. Like, gone, gone. You ain't taking it no more. <laughs> you like sod this. I'm happy. I don't need you. I'm. You're getting dumped. Someone's getting blocked, dumped. Yeah. Hundred percent. Good for you, man. Don't need no negative energy. You've got deeper things to concentrate on. You're moving forward. Yeah. You're on to the next, or you or you've been on to the next. Like this person could be chained to you for like. I don't know, years or something. They've just got something over you. It doesn't have to be... Yeah, it could be literally anything. Someone's got a hold over you. Your mind, almost. You know? You're still sexually attracted to them? I don't know. But Capricorn always seems, has been dominating you guys' energy for the last week or so, I'm sure of it. You know, um, maybe someone's been lying to you. Like, like I said, with the with the Ace of Swords, you're cutting through the bullshit. Yeah, this is someone cutting through the bullshit. This is someone that wants justice. <laughs> Yeah, they're like, justice is going to be served on you, bitch. Karma. Somebody needs to face up to the reality with this situation. Maybe the Capricorn needs to face up to it. Or you need to face up to a situation. But you're still analysing their motives and I don't think their motives are good. You need to cut it. You really need to do we need the Knight of Swords up in this bitch. Yeah. Two 
some of you are getting married. Like, some of you are getting married and stuff like that. Unions, two becoming one, you know. See? Time to toast, get married, live a happy life, ever after. <laughs> You ain't gonna get what you want from this person. This devil energy, it's not gonna happen. Congratulations to those that are getting married. honeymoons and holidays definitely you need to you need to like yeah it's all about it's all about love honeymoons coming up here and you've got to have confidence that what you're doing is the right thing Scorpio the strength some of you haven't got the strength to tie it to, to really break the, these ties but you need to you, you do my darlings the situation won't end in in a certain way that that you expected probably or the situation won't end if you won't let it, basically. It's in your hands. The power's in your court, really. Um, but I see a lot of you've got stuff to celebrate. Maybe this person's got... You've got... There's a secret. Maybe there's a secret here. They've got a secret on you. That's what it is. Like emotional blackmail sort of thing. Some of you, I think I said this already, you need to get advice. You need to get advice. Yeah, get advice from the women around you. If you have any Virgo women around you, get advice. I'm not taking the piss. <laughs> like, this is crazy, but yeah, if you've got. An earth woman around you. That's that's Capricorn. No, 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 forget Capricorn. <laughs> you don't want Capricorn's energy. I suggest a Taurus or a Virgo. Virgo woman's coming up here, right? Yeah, I'm gonna finish it because um, the Queen of Ariel. Yeah, mature, practical, generous, happy. Nurture yourself and those you love. The ability to make anything more beautiful, practical and wise advice. Uh-huh. This is what you need to do, my darlings. I love y'all, okay? <laughs> Have a beautiful, beautiful Thursday. I'll catch you next Thursday. Thirsty Thursday. Hmm? Somebody's thirsty. <laughs> Maybe you. You need to stay away from trouble and what's not serving you, okay? And congratulations to those getting married. Love, peace and light from me to you. Ciao, ciao until next week. Peace.